One of the International Monetary Fund's key roles in the global economic system is to set aside money and lend it to countries at times of difficulty. The goal is to stabilize their monetary systems. The fund has allocated capital using a system called special drawing rights. Until now, a basket of four currencies, the US dollar, the euro, the Japanese yen, and the British pound sterling. The inclusion of the renminbi in the special drawing right basket will further diversify it and will make its composition more representative of the global currencies and the global economy. It is a significant change for the fund because since the euro, this is the first time that a new currency is included to that basket. The IMF's executive board decided the renminbi will now represent just over 10% of this basket of currencies, the third largest after the US dollar and the euro. The intention is to better reflect the realities of global trade and finance. It is an important step in the integration of the Chinese economy into the global financial and monetary system. The renminbi's inclusion reflects the progress made in reforming China's monetary, foreign exchange and financial systems. And it acknowledges the advances made in liberalizing and improving the infrastructure of the financial markets. The decision was made possible because China has gradually shifted towards a currency management system which better reflects market forces, allowing the renminbi to become freely usable around the world. The IMF clearly sees this shift in broad historic terms, predicting it will enhance the growth and stability of China and the international economy. Daniel Wrenches, CCTV, Washington.